In this tutorial I'm gonna do a variable look. It might be too much makeup for some people, but for me this is what I wear every day. The first thing I do after moisturizer is applying my foundation, which is YSL Youth Liberator Serum Foundation in the color Beige Rose. The next thing I do is to highlight and conceal with my MAC Pro Longwear in the color NC15. And then I prime my eyes using Too Faced Shadow Insurance and I add a white eyeshadow on top of it, which is called Blanc Type. Uh, for me this works as a good base for the other colors I'm adding later on. The next step is to do my brows using the Anastasia Deep Brow Pomade in the color Auburn. My transition color is this color called Quarry by MAC and if you don't know what a transition color is, that is a shade that it's uh, going to blend out and even out the edges between the brow color and the crease color. On my lid I placed this color called All That Glitters and it's by MAC but I added some expensive pink on top because I wanted more color. To darken up my crease I used this color called Embark and it's a dark brown matte color that works very good as a darkening color for the crease. out any potential harsh edges with my 224 brush from MAC. For my lower lash line I used this color from MAC which is called Woodwinked. and for that I'm using my MAC Fluid Line in the color Black Track.
using my uh, Urban Decay Perversion Mascara. To set my foundation, I'm using this Bare Minerals uh, powder in the color Medium Beige. the liner and lipstick that I'm applying later on. I'm using this Prep and Prime Lip Primer from MAC. The lip liner I'm using for this look is this color called Subculture by MAC. By the way, I have a scar on my lip from when I was little. YSL uh, Rouge Volupt in the color 1. And that is it for this look and I hope you liked it and if you did please subscribe.